Hey guys, Derek with the Travelist. I'm going a little more over fire, especially on how to light it and what to use. Um, the biggest thing up next is volume. Um, it's very important to actually pack your tinder very tightly together, so that way you can actually move it a little bit easier. Um, more it's mostly considered kindling. Um, you can call it whatever you want, tinder kindling, whatever. It's your basic fire starting kit. Um, you want to get the most dry weather fire making stuff, and I want to show you guys the new addition. Oh, got a little bit of spit up. We just invaded. <laughs> and I, I want you guys to meet Kenny. New addition. A month old. Will soon be month old. One month. Can you say hi? Come here, <laughs> But. Yeah, destruction level. <laughs> yes, yeah, our new addition. Wanted to introduce her to a little, to you guys a little bit. Um, anyway, back to the tinder and kindling. You want to make sure it's very dry, packed together, so that way it's easy to travel with. Um, a lot of failures are actually in this regard. So you actually want to make sure you gather a lot of it. Because you're going to be getting a lot of fires going. And that's what you're going to burn through the most. Um, so make sure you have a good supply of it. So that way you know you're not going to run out of it. And make sure you get a fire going. Um, so make sure you have a pile almost the equivalent to a pile of wood. That you're going to want to have. Just so that way you know you're not going to come up short on it. Um, especially when it's dry and it's anything like that. That way, you're more guaranteed to actually get a fire going. Um, especially if you're going to be using the branches, the twigs, and, you know, anything like that. You don't want to get too big, because otherwise your fire will not start. So make sure you start off small and get bigger. And it's kind of like having a baby. You don't want to watch them grow. Versus, you know, just have them come out and then boom, something happens, can't get it going. Um, so, yeah, in that aspect, you want to make sure you feed your fire to watch it grow. Um, yes, uses my baby as an analogy, which is actually a good point to prove. Um, you want to make sure you feed them and watch them grow. It's kind of like, you know, life. But other than that, that's the uh, basis for some of your fire needs. Okay. I'll be hitting a little more on that. Okay. Hope you guys stay tuned. Subscribe. Like. Posted for you.